President Hage Gaingob initiated the voluntary contribution in response to the severe drought threatening people's livelihood and livestock. Nevonga reassured workers that government engaged the union on the matter and is confident no one was going to be victimized for choosing not to contribute. When you set the threshold, even if I want to contribute 1% or 0.5%, which is uh, something, I will not be able to, to do that because the, 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 the threshold is 2% and I cannot afford 2%. You find employees in, in, in that situation. I think the call by the government has not looked at the other, if, uh, have not looked at that consideration. It has just offered that two percent. Maybe in fear that if you have option, maybe people will go to the law, to to the lower one. It's either way. But uh, if I did not give, if I give one percent or one point five, it's better than not having given anything because I cannot afford two percent. However, Peter Nevonga says the union leaves the decision on whether to contribute or not to individual employees. On the issues of elections, Nevonga urged workers to unite after the election processes, saying elections were a democratic process necessary to choose leadership. Our preferred candidate should not exceed our common objective. Now you find election is conducted, uh, members, some won, others did not won, because some even called those who did not won, they, 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 they are regarded as losers or so. There's no losers, because we are not enemy. Samuel Kue Amseb was elected branch chairperson.